Victor was an amazing person, the kindest, had the best laugh, had the best smile, and my best friend. The pain is still raw for a grieving wife as she steals herself to come face to face in court with the man accused of killing her husband. The details of the murder, just chilling. The body of 47-year-old Victor Huff was found wrapped in a tarp near railroad tracks. A tragedy, both mysterious and heartbreaking. 19 News with a wife's plea for justice. It's something no one should ever have to deal with, but she's speaking out tonight to share who her husband was and what he meant to his family. Caitlin McCarthy with the emotional conversation. He loved his family, all of his family. He loved my family. He loved his friends and they it made them feel good, made those people better people because of his love. Victor Huff was the love of his wife's life. She didn't feel comfortable sharing her identity on camera, but she shares with us what her husband meant to her. Longtime friends before 15 years of devotion. What made him such an incredible husband, but also friend to you? How do you describe your, how do you describe someone that you can just like connect with? You can't, cause you connect. In August of 2022, her life changed forever. According to police, she grew worried when he wasn't returning calls or text messages. And after learning he didn't show up to work, she reported him missing. The day after being reported missing, his body was found in the city's Clark Fulton neighborhood wrapped in a tarp. The medical examiner said the 47-year-old died from multiple gunshot wounds. Now this man, Harry Houston, will be on trial for aggravated murder. Testimony is expected to be difficult for Huff's loved ones. He would say, babe, monkey, monkey, I'm so sorry. That's what he would say, monkey, I'm so sorry. She wants her husband remembered for the impact he had on so many who knew him. Victor was an amazing person, the kindest, had the best laugh, had the best smile, and my best friend. Three others have pleaded guilty in this case, and Houston's trial is set to begin on Monday. And Huff's wife hopes her husband gets justice. Reporting outside the Justice Center, Caitlin McCarthy, 19 News.